Hi folks, this is Jonathan Bowen with Jonathan Bowen Real Estate LLC. You can reach me at 855-879-4663. Again, 855-879-4663. Or on the web at www.bowenboston.com. And that's www.bowenboston.com. All right, this is 79 Bray Road, B-R-A-E Road in Weymouth. Uh, it's a beauty. Uh, it's a three-bedroom... Uh, well, let's go take a look at it. It is a cape. Uh, you can see the gas meter on the left-hand side of the stairs there. Uh, this property needs uh, a ton of work. It needs to be rehabbed. Uh, obviously, the driveway, you can start with the driveway. On the left here, this is asbestos siding. And uh, that's probably going to need to be removed at some point. All right, so we got to walk in the side door into the kitchen. Uh, you know, small, it's very small, post-war cape, uh, you know, this is what, uh, they built after the war for the GIs coming home, so, uh, hardwood floors, uh, throughout the house, except for the kitchen, it seems like, in the bathrooms, and they all need to be refinished, okay, um, let's go this way to the left rear of the house, and this is a bedroom back here, technically, all right, uh, window broken, I guess. Small little bedroom here, okay. Closet, all right. Let's look at the bathroom here. This is the first floor bathroom. Uh, you know, hey, it needs to be rehabbed. It needs to be pulled apart, okay. Uh, and let's go to the front left side of the property. And I guess technically you have two bedrooms on the first floor, although uh, most people wouldn't use it as uh, well, I don't know. It depends. Every, every family situation is different. Some may use it as a bedroom, some may not. Um, this is a little bit bigger. This is probably the biggest bedroom in the house, and it's still small. This is just a closet, uh, you know, linen closet or whatever it might be. All right, let's go. Uh, let's head upstairs. Let's go take a look at uh, the bedrooms up here. Steep staircase, again, typical post-war cape. We're going to go to the right-hand side of the property, as if you were looking at it from the street. And uh, the ceiling height isn't fantastic. you got some eaves back there, so if you ever wanted to bump out the eaves, you got some eaves over here as well, probably. I haven't opened up that door. You know, you might think about throwing on a dormer here if you're going to rehab it. Here's your closet, okay? Uh, floors, again, need to be... Uh, rehabbed up here. I think they're salvageable though. Uh, here's your bathroom, stand up shower. Up here, it's a mess. We'll go to the back of the property and we'll see the uh, we'll see the dormer. I think they probably added the dormer on for this bathroom, but whatever. It is a mess, okay? All right, so we're at the left hand side of the property here, smaller bedroom, okay? does have replacement windows, the house does, but I think it's probably best if you're going to rehab this, just uh, put in all new windows. They've seen their, uh, their time there. There's the plumbing for that bathroom. Uh, all right, so let's head downstairs to the basement. Okay. Down the steep staircase. And... All right. All right, let's go down to the spooky basement. Woo! I've yet to find a dead body in any one of these basements. All right, so here's your water meter. Uh, this is the front left of the uh, property, okay? Um, this is your uh, walk, uh, well, your, uh, what do you call it? Bulkhead, thank you. That's your bulkhead uh, stairs. Uh, waste pipes, they look like they're rusting out. Could probably use some PVC there. Here's your heating system. It's a Conquest 90 Century by Heat Controller Incorporated. I don't know how, how old it is. Uh, it is a gas system and it's a forced hot air system. Uh, here's your water tank. Hot water tank. Looks like it's rusting out to me. Yay, rust. That looks like it's gas as well. Okay. Uh, let's see. Poured concrete foundation. A uh, bunch of graffiti on it. Uh, here's your electrical system. Looks like it needs to be upgraded. 
Uh, here's another window that's been blocked off, I guess. So anyway, that is the lovely basement of 79 Bray Road in Weymouth. Now we're going to head outside to take a look at the backyard. Actually, I'll be honest, the lot's pretty nice. It's probably the nicest part of the property. Uh, big, big lot. All right. So let's go take a look at the rear here, the rear of the property. And uh, you can see that they have some asbestos siding and on top of that they have asphalt siding. And on top of that, that little white patch that you see there, that is the original clapboard siding, which was probably in great shape when they first built this house. But now they have all the nails from all of the asphalt siding that they put on, and then they have the nails from the uh, asbestos siding on top of that. So they ruined a perfectly good siding job because somebody was too lazy to paint the frickin' cape, which probably would have taken three days, four days. <laughs> Instead, uh, they got sold by some siding salesman, not once, but twice. Probably once in the late 40s, early 50s with, the, the, with that asphalt, and then uh, probably sometime in the 60s with the, uh, with the asbestos. Okay, I'll get off my horse there, my, 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 my uh, soapbox. Anyway, all right, so here we go. We got the... Uh, we got the roof, which needs to be replaced. We, the chimney looks like it's in decent shape. That's that window in that, that back bedroom that uh, is a bad, uh, bad window there. So there's your bulkhead from the basement. So that's it. That's 79 Bray Road in Weymouth. It's uh, bank owned property. Uh, and that's it. Any questions, call me up. Uh, email me. Do whatever you got to do. Send me smoke signals. Uh, this is Jonathan Bowen with Jonathan Bowen Real Estate LLC and uh, you can reach me at the office at 855-879-4663 again 855-879-4663 uh, or on the web at www.bowenboston.com and that's www.bowenboston.com uh, thanks guys take care bye bye